Hi everybody, my name's Kevin. I work at the Kookaburra. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make a Kalita wave. Before we get started, I wanna show you all the items that you're gonna need. Kalita wave, freshly ground coffee, hot water, one filter, scale, timer, and something to stir with. Awesome, now that we have all of our materials together, it's time to actually make the Kalita wave. Uh, first thing I like to do always is warm up the actual serving pitcher here and also uh, wet the filter, um, help get rid of any of that paper taste. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and add some water to the filter, helps to set it in place. And like I said, get rid of that paper taste as well as heat up the pitcher beneath. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put that aside while that's warming up. And now it's time to weigh out some coffee. Um, turn on my scale. I'm using some of our Colombian today. This is definitely a really nice coffee that we offer. Um, really bright. Um, definitely our, uh, I would say, sweetest offering that we have here at the Kookaburra. I'm gonna use uh, the one to 16 brew ratio like we've talked about before. Again, I'm gonna use 25 grams of coffee, just like I do for the Chemex. So I'm gonna go measure that out. And now I'm gonna grind that up. So now that we've ground up the coffee, um, not too fine, not too coarse, somewhere in between, um, almost like table salt. So now that my uh, Kalita Wave's actually warmed up, I wanna discard the excess water here. Reassemble everything on top of my scale and tear it back out and go ahead and add that 25 grams of coffee to the filter. Now, just like I did with the Chemex, before I start adding water to this, I wanna make sure I level out that bed. So I'm just gonna pick it up and just give it a little subtle shake here, level that out, and I'm gonna tear out my scale again. And now I'm gonna add uh, the first bit of water to my Kalita Wave, um, give it a little bit of time for it to bloom. So I'm gonna add about 50 grams and wait about 30 seconds for that to happen. So I'm gonna start my time here and go ahead and put that first 50 grams in. Nice, slow, controlled pour. Grab my spoon and go ahead and stir this, making sure every bit of those grinds are touched by the water so we have a nice, even extraction. And just rinse that spoon off and make sure every bit of grind stays in the Kalita Wave. Awesome, so now we're just gonna wait for it to bloom for a second. Um, you can see the CO2 uh, pushing through the water, um, causing it to bubble up. So now I'm gonna keep adding about close to 50 grams every 30 seconds until I get to my final product of 400 grams. All right, so now it's time to add the last 50 grams of water. So after I put this last 50 grams in, I'm gonna use my spoon to do one more little subtle agitation. Make sure everything drips down the way it should. And now we just wait a few moments for it to finish dripping through. Um, ideally at the end, you're gonna have a nice, flat, even level bed, meaning that you had a nice, flat, uh, even extraction. Um, and then you'll just be able to grab your mug, serve it up and enjoy. All right, so now that all my coffee's dripped through, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of the filter. So just remove the top here, throw it away. And now I'm left with a nice little pot of Kalita Wave. Enjoy. And you can have it actually. <laughs> there you go. Cool. Um, so.